right now on Fox 5 News at 10. Ghost guns now available online. The blueprints detailing how to make untraceable weapons are ready for download. Good evening, I'm Erica Walker. Those instructions were scheduled to be posted August 1st, but they are now available to almost anyone with an internet connection. And as Fox 5 has learned exclusively, the company behind those blueprints is now taking action against authorities who tried to stop them from releasing the plans. Mike Sachs joins me now with the very latest. Mike. Hey, Erica. Yeah, just days ago, the Texas-based company Defense Distributed began posting 3D-printed gun files to its webpage. Thousands of downloads later, the company is turning its sights on states like New Jersey that try to stand in its way, while New York lawmakers offer their own bills to stop a new generation of do-it-yourself firearms. Code for Defense Distributed's undetectable 3D-printed handgun, the Liberator, has had 1,300 downloads and counting since Friday. That's when a federal judge approved the company's settlement with the Trump administration over the protests of gun safety advocates like New Jersey Attorney General Gerber Gruel, who a day earlier sent a cease and desist letter to Defense Distributed. As the chief law enforcement officer for New Jersey, I demand that you halt publication of the printable gun computer files. Should you fail to comply with this letter, my office will initiate legal action barring you from publishing these files before August 1, 2018. Instead, Defense Distributed did publish its files, and the company's lawyer in an exclusive interview with Fox 5 News says they're suing New Jersey's attorney general. The government does not have the power to tell people they can't post information on the Internet. That's a violation of free speech. Also, state law is trumped by federal law, and the U.S. State Department gave our clients a license to post these files online. Uh, so this is an unconstitutional action in every respect. While Defense Distributed tries to test those arguments in a Texas federal court, New York lawmakers are pushing for legislation banning so-called ghost guns. Every day that passes without a law that bans the creation and sale and distribution of 3D guns endangers the public because those guns are untraceable by law enforcement. But while State Senator Brad Hoylman's bill may have to wait till the state legislature returns to session in January, U.S. Senator Chuck Schumer is hoping his new bill gets swifter action from Congress. I'm confident that our legislation will pass very, very quickly. We have bipartisan support. And this is, I was the one who exposed this last Sunday. It has now caused outrage throughout the Senate and House, and I'm expecting our legislation will pass soon. Now, unless or until that happens, the codes will be online, with Defense Distributed's AR-15 blueprint outpacing the Liberator's downloads. Still, Defense Distributed has blocked access to its site from inter for Internet users from Los Angeles, Pennsylvania, and, yes, New Jersey. All places that have threatened to sue are being sued by, or in Pennsylvania's case just this afternoon, unsuccessfully sued the company. Erica? Fascinating stuff, Mike. Thank you.